Let's get educated by Ted on why you should set pin to drive for your Tesla. And I'll show you how to do it. There are two reasons why I think it's important for you to set pin to drive. The first reason is if you use your phone as a key and you ever leave your phone in the car, someone can just come right in behind you, get in the vehicle and then drive away. And you're gonna obviously have the pain and suffering of retrieving it. The second is a video that I recently saw where an owner of a Tesla was able to get into someone else's Tesla and vice versa. And so that's kind of freaky. I'm not sure if that was a hoax or whatever, but it seems very legitimate and that information has been sent to Tesla. So hopefully they'll correct that. But in the meantime, what you can do is set pin to drive. Now, I took a survey on Twitter a little while ago and approximately one out of every three Tesla owners sets pin to drive. Here's why you should make sure you're at least one of those one to three. Okay. Let me show you now how to set your pin to drive. So we're in the vehicle, you hit the menu button and then you wanna go into the safety menu there. And then you want to scroll up and you actually have two pin options. There's pin to drive and there's a glove box pin. Those are actually individual pins. You can set them the same, but you don't necessarily have to. And you set them exactly the same way. You basically slide uh, the, the the item over so let's just do the pin to drive for now so we slide it over and now you enter a pin that you want so i'm just going to do it as an example here this isn't going to be the pin of my vehicle um, but i'll just set that and now there you go and when you have pin to drive as soon as you put your foot on the brake it's going to say hey you have to enter your pin and of course i showed you the pin that uh, temporary one that I had and now you can see I can put the car in reverse and then I can go and that's it so it's super simple for you to set it up strongly recommend that you do it thank you for watching this video if you found the content interesting please click the like button and subscribe if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos please put them in the comments